In this video, I'll explain how you can perform a system recovery using external recovery media, such as a recovery USB stick or DVD, on your Windows 7 computer. For performing a system recovery on a Windows 8 Toshiba computer, see our other video. Performing a system recovery restores the computer to the original factory image and erases all existing data. This includes files, folders, programs, drivers, emails, and photos. Before performing a system recovery, back up all personal files if possible. If you have not backed up your personal files, the data will be lost. You can perform a system recovery from the hard drive recovery utility, but this is explained in another video. Connect your recovery USB stick, or place the first disk of the recovery DVDs in your DVD drive. Turn off the computer. Do not put it into sleep mode or hibernation. After a moment, turn the computer back on. When the initial Toshiba splash screen appears, press F12. The boot menu should appear. If the boot menu does not appear, shut down the computer and try again holding F12 as you start it. In the boot menu, select the USB option if using the recovery USB stick, or the DVD option, which might be called ODD, if using the recovery DVDs. Note that media must be inserted for the icon to appear. In this example, both USB and ODD media are inserted, so both are available as selections. You should see a warning screen explaining the process. Depending on your model, you might see a different screen. Read the information on the screen, and then continue following the prompts. The prompts will lead you through the entire recovery process. You should now know how to perform a system recovery using external recovery media on your Windows 7 Toshiba computer. For more information, visit support.toshiba.com.